Hello guys, sorry for the noise, there's construction going on. Today I want to show you my um, homemade, uh, this is a homemade uh, miniature, I guess you could call it a Turkish bow, I, I don't know, something. I made it, uh, sorry the airplane, I made it uh, using PVC pipes. What I did is I cut the PVC pipes in the middle. See this PVC pipe? This is a, well, it's definitely longer than this, but I cut it down the whole length of it in the middle. Like that. And uh, there's like three of them here stacked on top of each other. You know? And uh, what I did is I, I put a fiberglass rod to make it more, more, poundage you know give it more poundage because with the pvc pipes alone the pvc alone it's quite weak now it's got <sighs> yeah wow it looks beautiful i like these style of bows they're, they're good looking And the arrow flies very straight. See if it's powerful enough. It hit a new spot. Uh, and, and don't get me wrong, this is some really thick, strong foam or whatever you want to call this, whatever this is made from. This is not like weak either, this is like strong, man. And at the back here, it's like reinforced with like plastic. This is like plastic, you see? Um, it's actually quite simple to make. All you need is plywood, PVC, two PVC pipes, because there's three layers of uh, PVC, flattened PVC, here. And uh, this string's gonna be cut soon, so this is just um, a test anyway. I'm gonna make it more nicer looking, don't worry about that. Look how beautiful. It looks. That's how beautiful this looks. And it's got some power to it. And yeah. Or, oh, um, right now I have one. So these are the, as you can see, there's, uh, these are the layers of PVC. And behind, oh, whoops, the target fell down. Behind the PVC is a single uh, fiberglass rod from an arrow, a fiberglass arrow that I cut. And it goes all along the length of it, as you can see. You could add more if you want to make it more powerful. But one's enough, this is just a test, you know. I gotta fix the sears as well, cause they're kinda crooked, as you can see. So they need fixing. See, this one's very crooked. I'll, I'll, I'll see what I could do about that. Probably cut it a bit 
make it more flatter down here. Anyway, yeah, this is, I guess this is a success, sort of. I'm happy with this. It, it works, you know, it works. And it's got, it's got quite some power even with one uh, fiberglass rod. It's got quite some power. This is what the fiberglass rod looks like. I cut it off of an arrow and that's what's in there. I could put another one, make it much more powerful than it already is. You could add more power to it by just adding more of these rods. It's actually quite simple. Right. Look at that, it looks quite good. I like these style of bows, they're my favourite. Because they're small but powerful. And they're good looking. I like the, the way they look. They're just beautiful. Thanks for watching, thanks and bye bye.